Okay, I'm going to show you how to set up proxy firewall to run through the Tor proxy network automatically with um, your programs on your computer if you so desire. Okay, to get the Tor Vidalia bundle, go to torproject.org, click on download. That will take you to the uh, download page. In my case, I'm using Windows Vista, so I'll go to Advanced Choices and select the proper bundle for your whatever flavor computer you got operating system. Um, in my case, I'm using Windows, so I'm going to select the Windows bundle. I'm not going to show you how to set it up. Uh, they got good support, so you can do figure that out yourself. Now you want to go to proxyfirewall.org, and as you notice, I'm from Ukraine. <laughs> I'm actually in the United, in the United States, but I'm going through. Uh, through the uh, Tor plug-in button uh, in uh, uh, Firefox. It's a plug-in for Firefox. And you just click the button and it'll go through the Tor network and hide your tracks. Anyway, here's the Vidalia interface where you can start and stop Tor as needed. You can also use the uh, new identity that uh, uh, gives you a new IP number, refreshes the IP to a different IP number. Then you can view the network, which you shouldn't have to do, technically. Um, it's more or less plug and play once you set it up. But if you like, you can go check it out. To hide it to your toolbar. Once you got proxy firewall set up, go to rules and you can set you can set settings for each and every program that you run. Uh, you can allow all connections or you can block all connections. Or in our case, which we're concerned with in this video, you can set up uh, set it up to run through the Tor proxy network. Go to open proxies, and I've already got it set up, uh, but I'll show you how to set it up new. Enter 127.0.0.1 and port 9050. Add to list and click OK which it didn't do anything since I already have it, but that adds it to your list of open, open proxies. Now when you use a uh, program for the first time, it'll pop up a box to intercept the uh, connection where you can select to allow proxies, I mean allow the connection, no proxy, or uh, block all connections which blocks the application from connecting to the internet or use proxy server click here to select a new proxy server select the open, drop down open the proxies go to your 127 which is your local host and you can set to so you can Tune those settings, but it's not necessary. Click OK. This is my email program, Pegasus, which uh, I've already had set up, but I'm just showing you how to connect it through a proxy. See, now here's the uh, log on proxy firewall. If you noticed, it connected through the local host, which is the uh, which is set up for the Tor network, so it's running through the Tor network now. And 
that's pretty much all there is to it.